Good morning. It is the fifth Sunday in Easter, and our church is dressed in white. During the season of Easter, we look for new beginnings and new life that is all around us. Once there was someone who said such amazing things and did such wonderful things that the people who followed him just had to ask him, who are you? In last week's story, we heard Jesus say, I am the shepherd and you are my sheep. And then we learned how the shepherd took good care and watched over his sheep. So this week, when the disciples asked Jesus, who are you? Jesus replies with, I am the true vine and you are the branches. No branch can produce fruit unless it is attached to the vine. So stay close to me and I will stay close to you. So I wonder how we can stay close. Do you have any ideas? Zoom Sunday School? That's a great idea. Singing songs? That's another good one. Reading the Bible? Oh, perfect. And praying? Well, now that you mention it, I found a new way to pray this week and it's called photo prayers. And it is something you just choose a time of the day that you sit down with some family photos or maybe you pick some photos off the internet and you hold those and you say, God bless who's ever in the picture. So come do it with me. God bless the polar bears. God bless my grandmother. God bless my friend when they're sad. God bless the raccoon in my backyard. God bless the earth. God bless my friends. After the final picture, you say, Amen. And this is something you can repeat every night whenever you have a chance to pray over these special people. And it's a super simple and effective prayer and helps you and me to stay close to God and close to Jesus. Well, that is the good news for today. Go in peace and remember that God loves you and so do I.